performance dito ni Lasty using the grab. Si Lina naman and uh, Claude for the late game for Indonesia. Maganda yung first 3 picks dito ng Indo. Uh, parang ano, no? damage agad yung damage, uh, gustong yes. iba to dito ng Indonesia. And actually, for uh, the Selena pick, lagi natin sinasabi yan na bago na siya, planning. pwede na ang mag-arrival. So, we could see an arrival ex-Borg yes. for this team Indonesia knowing that the Abyssal Trap ay pwede ng arrivalan. Pero again, Basha. pinanggit natin yan kanina, Basha Anon, eh, nakuha na naman dito ng ating Philippines. Pero Granger, as you could see, ladies and gentlemen, that is one of the comfort picks ni uh, paring uh, Few or ni uh, paring uh, Arkanghel for Team Philippines. Nakita natin sa mga previous days or for the whole story of this MLBB uh, SEA Games tournament is that ang taas ng uh, picking percentage dito ng Team Philippines whenever open ang isang Granger. Yes, tsaka Your ito pa, take note ha, yung ating basya dito, I think isa lang yung talo na ito. Ni, ni isa buong tournament ng SEA Games, isa lang yung talo. And yung nakatalo lang sa kanya is the, Your team the Indonesia, kung di ako nagkakamali. Yun lang yung talo dito ng Philippines. And ngayon, Cho will pick dito for the side of Team Philippines. Kenji yung gagamit. This is a fighter, Cho. Oo, oh, a planer, sa, tama. Uh, sa Philippines. Although, uh, nung isang araw, medyo hindi ganun kaganda yung naging performance ni Kenji on the Cho. Pero pag nating sa split push, we could uh, say na Cho is a good uh, pick for Team Philippines kasi pwedeng-pwedeng-pwede siyang mangulit sa mapa. Pero ito, Um, interesting pick for uh, Team Indonesia is the Minotaur. Si Minotaur, uh, mga Season 3, may kita natin siya part of the meta. Pero this time around, for Team Indonesia, may kita natin siya for the Grand Finals ng SEA Games 2019. Yes, pero ngayon, uh, wala na pala tayong uh, marksman dito. Pwede ma ma baka mapilitan. Yung Hellcurt. Philippines dito mag- uh, yun, assassin. Speaking of assassin, that is the Hellcurt. Ang last pick dito. Resurrecting soon. Okay. Okay, so we're back. We're back, guys. We're back, we're back, we're Here back. Here we go. Here we go, game number one. Game number one. That was just a pump fake. That was just, that a, was pump just fake. a pump fake for the draft. As we are now seeing, ladies and gentlemen, Team Indonesia, they do have the lead right now with the first blood. What do you think about the draft, brothers? I mean, looking at the draft for the side of the Philippines, they are really trying to go for the slate game because uh -huh. they do have Arkangel on that health card. Well, for the side of Indonesia, they just need to go for the pickoffs. And as I've said yesterday, yeah. Indonesia, they're really strong yes. in this pickoff game. They are definitely our uh, butters. I like what Indonesia is doing right now. They are, they are a very uh, team fight oriented. Uh, they have a team fight oriented uh, composition because of the Mino 1's Fury plus the Blazing Duet. They are the end with the Diamond Force. But as I say this, there is another team fight here in the mid lane that is, of course, Ridwan getting his first kill of the game. Castro Mayor will just run away. So, in terms of controlling the tempo of the early game, Indonesia.
Alicia having the clear advantage. They really know how to put the strings of the game. Arcangel here being the target, okay. and he will get copy. But now, Arcangel will be going down to that export. This is what I like about Team Indonesia. It's not about how you play it mechanically. It's not about the draft. Look at this. Um, look at Putra on playing this uh, this Minotaur. Look at the mind games that he's doing. He is like Bataan here. Bataan on going in for the zone. But Putra also plays that zone game as well. But meanwhile, as I say this, Team Philippines, they're trying to get this big cow. But still, Putra, tanky enough to heal himself. That is going to be the stun coming in for uh, Bataan on the Team Philippines. They will just go for their own uh, river grab for this game. Slowly but surely, Philippines wants to get back at Indonesia for those three early kills that they got. Yes. But Indonesia right now, they're really be uh, they're really being careful. Yep. Like they are not giving any chances for the side of the Philippines to initiate a team fight. Because right now Indonesia they know they don't have the team ability and they can yeah. only go for the top. Their up is the Kino victory. That is of course an ultimate for uh, Arcangel to get away. Julianto having two kills right now. But the Anon and company, they're trying to set up this tier one tower in the bottom lane. But the Anon doing the Bataanon way, just um, confusing out Team Indonesia, either painting all of the skills or just um, probably tanking up and soaking up more damage to create space for his team. Castro Mayor also with a good uh, first kill to uh, probably put in the fear to bear down. And of course, Gustain. Gustian, sorry. Gustian here. He is trying to find all the farm in the world that he can get right yes. now. And with the side of Indonesia having the lead on kills, uh -huh. it seems to me that he has all the freedom to go for soon. any objective on the map. They're buying time. They're creating space. It's going to be the Gushin game for, uh, I'm sorry, the Claude game for uh, Gus Chan. I mean, they have the same name. It's Gus yes. and the Gus Chan. Yes. So it, it's the Claude. It's the Claude. He's using the Claude. He's using the Claude. But again, that is a stun coming in from Bataan. Both of these teams buying time for uh, their respected, uh, respected uh, core heroes. Meanwhile, you do have this um, uh, Selena threat coming in from Team Indonesia uh, to negate all of the potential titans for Team Philippines. And look at this, Putra just using his ultimate just to steal the buff. Uh -huh. But right now, they're at a very bad position. Philippines here, they really want to get back. One kill, Minotaur will go down. Minotaur will go down. Vilya is here for the backup. Here comes the Pomoseno going in for the single vision. And nice kick double kill. coming in from Pedro. That is the double kill coming in from the Pomoseno. And take that as triple kill. kill. But oh. still leading by one. And this is what we were uh, talking about earlier. Philippines, they just really want the team fight. Indonesia, they're not really capable to take anything right now. Yes. And they got uh, they got four kills out of that. In Philippines, they're at a very nice spot to, you know, to stop this, but they have to find a way to take care of Julianto. Julianto is playing out of his mind. Yes, this is the x Sports game for uh, for the taking, coming in from Julianto, having, of, of, of course, that um, fighter emblem, the blood, uh, the the festival of blood, which is this game. Oh, look at this! Album. Man, Ferdows is going down. This is the Castro Mayor and Bataanon uh, bouncer combination. Bouncer combination, the big boy. The big, big boy duo, the big, the big boy. boy duo. And they're putting the smackdown on Putra, but again, this is Putra, man. And Putra is, one, is probably the best. Oh, look at this! Look at this! And they Mega have to kill. take care of Julianto, and Julianto will go down. But right now, Pena on the okay. middle lane. He will go for the middle lane. And they will take down Melia. And look at this! Christian, he is the last man standing onto the middle lane. Putra will be helping him as well. But Castro Mayor, he will be the one who zones out everyone. A lot of confusing skirmishes happening here right now. Again, both of these teams having a team fight oriented lineup. But I do feel, Butters, that it's not about. Um, who has the better items. I think that it is about who plays the mind games. Yes. Who plays the mind yes. games. I is it going to be Putra 
or is it going to be Bataanon? I do agree, Manjin, because right now, the level of macro and micro play for these teams, they're really good at it. I yes. would say that they're equals, yes. but at the same time, it's all about the uh, choice, the fight choices that you yes. take. Because yes. right now, if you have the same items, and looking at the net worth, they're not really that, uh, you know... Uh, that, that far. That far right? to each other, so... Yeah. That, that's why this is the grand finals. That's why this is the best of the best. Meanwhile, Vila is looking in. Who will take the, uh, the turtle? It's going to be this uh, Lilia. But that is the sun coming from the Anon. Okay, Rid One will be able to survive that. But Ultra is just too tanky. One heck of a cow right here. Oh, what I yeah, he got hit. He got hit. Got hit by the Anon. Or the hell will go down and. This is what we meant about the Selena. Yeah. When you have a split pusher, you really need to take care of your surroundings. Definitely. Be alert. Yeah. Because that is, of course, the three second arrow up for the taking. Meanwhile, that is the defense coming in from Team Indonesia. Doesn't really want to give this uh, tier two tower. Sorry, in the bottom lane. And again, this is Claude in the late game, which can actually outplay a Hellcurt in terms of. Um, micro plays like if, if ever the Claude goes for the BMI and then just fake his uh, ultimate he can actually uh, burst down this health card quickly yes and that is one of the things that we have to look out for Julianto try to chase down uh, chase down Castro Mayor and Castro yes. Mayor isn't really faced about anything here and Gushan goes to the next target and Gushan gets nice hit arrow. nice shot arrow. Down. that is a check down onto the Harris and Patahano he is also falling low oh man For the first 10 minutes of our game, for that was just hitting all the arrows, man. They should have just went back rather than, uh, you know, forcing a kill on the other side. Yes. You don't really get anything out of it, and you can't really turn that into an objective. Yes. So I don't really know why they forced that. But it's because of the arrows, man. Again, there's a 50-50 chance of you getting, ki getting oh, killed. Oh, wow! Billia with outplay! Yeah, Billia going for the outplay. But man, I, I do feel that he... Lord, it's also gonna die soon. in the hands of this Lilia and Putra. Putra now having the Queen's wings. Back to what I was saying earlier. Back to what I was saying earlier, brothers. This is about who oh plays goodness. who plays the better Sony game. Who plays the better zoning game? And right now the black shoes will be committed. Nepomoteno hugging out Julianto. Julianto here just going for the fire missile, fire okay. sticks. And Castro Mayor being very tanky, he yes. zones out everyone the side here of Indonesia. But man. Putra is really lo looking scary right now. Probably the most dominant force in the game, I should say. The big boy. The big boy, the, the biggest big boy. boy there is. Bigger than Mataanon and bigger than Castro Mayor. So what will Philippines uh, do right now? I do feel that they need to um, target the Claude, probably go for pickups, force out a team fight, bait a good ultimate, and then go back. Because Team Indonesia, they have a lot of safe uh, mobility uh, mobility skills. You have the black shoes and you have the BMI plus the Piraga armor coming in for their team. Yes. So, and you don't really have to commit anything because you yes. have the abyssal arrow. And yes. that is one initiation factor that you have to look at. Definitely. Here, Team Philippines, you cannot get hit. If you get hit, it's going to be an instant initiation coming up from Indonesia. Definitely, definitely. The three second abyssal arrow. Plus you have this Claude, oh man, look at the damage of this Claude to Bataanon. Bataanon, half health right now for Daos. He is ta attacking the River Crab. They're setting up for the first Lord of this game, Villa in the export. They're out of this team fight. Both of the teams now having the Lord Dance. Okay, so Putra here, his Rage Meter actually went full. And right now, they're going to try and force out the ultimate, but Putra... Man. He doesn't have his rage up now, and they can take this fight. But Putra here has his you know what fury up, and he will be using it to have the, the question here, Butters, is how do you soften a cow? How do you, you soften a cow, before man? Before you marinate. Before you marinate it, because Putra is just proving us wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, 11-9. Lord is at half health. This one is taking care of it. Meanwhile, that is, of course, another box out play. Coming in for Putra. Villa. Villa going for the rat ammo place right now. The Trilla and Villa. And really really oh Trying to use the wild charge. That is, a, that is a sacrificial play. Come here, Castle Mayor. Oh, Villa. Villa. Okay. The lights are off. But again, that is last insanity. Villa going in for the push. Two Shut more down. hits. That is a shut down to the Lilia. Double check on Memo Moseno. He might actually get the kill. Oh, my goodness. He actually got the kill. 
Indonesia.